Greetings one and all, I'm Helix Oblivion and welcome back to All Well. Uh, days on duty thus far are four. Thank you for ensuring the safety of the nation's people. I don't feel like I'm doing that. I'll be honest with you, I feel like I've condemned at least one person to death. And it's all gone to pot. If you don't remember or haven't watched the last episode, please go back watch it. It's curious. Um, but yeah... There seems to be several people under threat and several people threatening us and yeah, it's all going to be interesting. Um, I don't know how long there's left of this game but I, I feel like it's, it's coming to its climax. I think it's coming to its end and I can't wait to see what it is. So let's dive in. Let's waste no more time and let's dive in and find out what's happening. Yeah, I did loads of stuff. Under the Spreading Chestnut Tree, Episode 5. Who the hell are you? Good morning, Investigator. Since you have the most powerful investigative tool at your disposal, I suspect you already know who I am. Catherine Delacroix, apparently. You, on the other hand, have been mediocre so far. You could not save the circle more, but at least you got the prime suspect. You will do better. I will be on your advisor in this case. This has become far too important to leave the case to the advisor with an exposed identity. Sims as well, but no longer fit to work on Orwell. Moving forward, we will not speak about him again. As far as you are concerned, he never existed. With yesterday's so-called revelation about Orwell sympathisers, this terrorist group has taken to the streets. We need to show all of the nation Orwell is keeping them safe. We won't allow some fools on a tr to trample on everything we've achieved. We must get rid of the imposter pretending to be Abraham Goldfeld. Find out who did it and where they are hiding. Oh my god! Headlines. House of Exposed Government Employee Van. Oh no, dude! Thought must gather once again. We will have a conference call at 4 p.m. sharp. We need to listen. A gathering we know about. Abraham Goldfeld is dead. Someone's been impersonating. This is as clear as a crystal. We must act swiftly and collect as much evidence as possible before this gathering commences. Thought is certainly up to no good. As you know, processing data chunks is time consuming. I would say we have time for roughly 20 data ch chunks to be, be considerate. <laughs> Oh, great. Truly sorry for having drawn the investigator's attention to you, but frankly, you overstepped the boundaries of our agreement. The bombs were meant as a warning to those who are indifferent, a beacon of remembrance to our message that the thoughts must always be free. They were not meant to kill. Once again, you disappoint me with your insurmountable hatred and rage. Consider our agreement void. Nina's dead, mate. They're all ghosting. You must think I'm stupid. First you don't tell me where you are going because you need to ghost. Then hours later you don't answer your phone. I, so I called Piers asking for you. She said she told me you were at Cyber Cafe Chestnut yesterday evening. She said you stormed in and furiously wrote something on your PC. Probably this outrageous blog post the news speaks of. Then stormed back out the door only to meet whom? Juliet? meaning you're back in action with this shitty group and her. I cannot believe it. So I'm now trying email so you can't dodge me any longer. You and me, we're done. I mean it. Mariam. Okay. So, who do I want to attach this to? No? 
Okay. Can't attach it to her, but I can probably attach it to Harrison. This is where Harrison O'Donnell did his dirt work, probably thinking we would not better track him down. We will track him down. We've gone through the information we have on the remaining suspects regarding the impersonalization of Abraham Goldfells. We have received further information from a reliable source that he's probably the leader of thought. He predicted the bombings. This alone makes him suspicious. We have no idea why he hid the posts on the thought blog and his timeline. We are yet to clarify why he would frequently would be would there why he would frequenting that's bad english why he would be frequenting a drugstore so often survival supplies perhaps well he was ill he had cancer numpty why would he have two health insurances it is apparent that harrison o'donnell might well be part of the bonton bombings he is probably the one impersonating goldfields i want you to prove this and lock him away for good I'm not particularly interested in the level life of a terrorist. Well, you should be, mate. Harrison O'Donnell. Well, come on. Talk. Where the hell are you? Why did you leave, Abes? Our plan was to hide somewhere until we were no longer public enemies, number one and two. Yeah, but that was before I found out what you did. What did you do? You exposed a government employee. Take a close look at what happened. They're after us now, for sure. Was that necessary? Look at the TMB. We've delivered, we've developed a following. If they prosecute us now, there'll be a public outcry. This tiny crowd with their banners won't stop a thing. We'll be gone forever once they get us. This is why I had to leave. Did you get Adrian's email? Yeah, that was crazy. I know, all of a sudden he's back and he has a plan. I can't believe it. Where was he this whole time? Will you attend this gathering? No? Yes? Maybe? Of course, if Abby's there, we must attend. I will hide away someplace. I can call in from my notebook. You should do the same. Don't hide anywhere you've been in the last 24 hours. They might check there first. Will do. Damn phone's gone. Just like you disappeared this morning. Haven't seen by chance. Jesus, can you not take care of your stuff? No, I've not seen your phone. Lost his phone. Thought you'd attached to it. Uh... Ah, try to track it down, but it doesn't say... Useful hint, if you encounter any hints to hideout locations, be sure to validate them by checking where they have stayed before first. Track it down. Doesn't send a signal, probably of, out of battery or something. Yeah, whatever. I'll go without it until the gathering. Yeah, until the gathering. Until the gathering. Initiate. Knock knock. Huh? Who are you? Names initiate. Oh, you're this hacker guy Harrison spoke about, right? Then? Right. Dude, yeah. So, you have the thought blog. You've been following us around. Why? What do you want? What I want. I want to know what happened to thought. These bombings have been ringing in my head. And just, I just don't know. Was this thoughts work? Was it government set up? Listen, I don't know either. I'm sorry, but shit is majorly going down the drain right now. If you can help us do, do it, please. May help got you where you right you were there. May my help got you where you're right now. You help dox this Kotsigan? Harrison told me you wouldn't want to assist us. Don't talk so openly, or did you forget what's going on? Right, sorry. 
Can you... Can you do that again? What you did? Nope. Damn. They're going to... Uh, this initiate is a nuisance. You must reveal his true identity. This might shed some light on what his motives are. They're going to trap me down for sure. Barely got out the last time. Need more intel on this thing first at the moment. I don't see a way. Damn. So, what are you doing? Oh, you don't know yet. Abraham Goldfell, so found his thoughts and his message. Thoughts should gather once more. What? Abe is back? Yeah, he says he has a plan. You know him? Kinda. Where from? Coincidence. Look, if you know Abraham, why don't you attend this gathering as well? It's going down 4pm as conference call. Give me your number, I'll invite you as well. No, thanks, but no thanks. Sounds like a trap to me. You shouldn't attend either. I'm pretty positive it's not. The email sounded authentic, but have it your way. I will. Good luck with this gathering. It does sound like a trap. Good luck with your finding out what's going on here. You're going to need it. Session closed. Okay. Need to apologize to you for remaining silent such a long time. I've been working out a plan in hiding. Today I need to call upon your help to make it happen. Whatever your capabilities and your skills, you need to stop trying to tear down walls instead. Shifting to running through open doors. Here's where to find one. 4 pm today. Okay. So I'm gonna try and set the goal all well once again. Well, let them come. Ah, hello. Personal. Life trust invoice, message for the great Hancock, your life trust invoice. Love you, Hancock. <laughs> okay, he's got fan art. Right. Cassandra's calling Joseph Langley? Law offices. Joseph! Cassie! They released me, I'm free to go. Wow, that's fantastic. I can't believe it, you must have had a hand in this for sure. Well, maybe I did. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Wait, I'm going to pick you up. You sure you don't have to work? Work and wait. What the hell happened to you? Is this the same Joseph Langley? It's a long story, I'll tell you on our way out. I'm so looking forward to seeing you again. Gonna be there in about mm, 20 minutes, see you soon. Yeah, can't be soon enough. Okay. Jules, she has a phone number. We have her phone number, we can listen in to her. I've only got five data chunks left. I'm probably not choosing quite as carefully as I ought to. Good, keep an eye on her as well. Oh, all busy. Victor Rosen, so Juliet Carrington. Don't know why he's French, but he is now. Carrington? Juliet, Victor here. Hey, Victor. I just talked to my. Oh, yeah, why are you not at work? Oh, I sent a signal. Didn't you read? No, you did not. You were here. The entire. You're entire the weekend. That is what the Tachter says. But no one authorized you to do so. Now that you're meant to be here, you are not. Also. What is Blura register under your account? This device ID does not belong to a company approved device. I, I, you will explain these irregularities. That seems unusual. Why would she at work then? Yeah. You will explain the irregularities. I want you in my office as soon as possible. I don't think so. Right. Oh, so much going on. Anyone else? Ah, Cassie. Ah, do we need Cassie's phone number? Probably should. She's out now, so we want to better track her. Don't stop here. Most likely, I only have time for one more upload. Make sure it counts. Oh no!
Oh yeah. That's the one we want. Let me have a look at other things first. Oh, oh, oh no. Can I get all of these? Oh no. Who wrote that resin chain? Oh, I don't know what to pick! Oh god, I'm gonna make the wrong decision, aren't I? I'm gonna go for the phone number. What do you expect to happen on his mobile phone line? It's 4pm. I expect us to follow him. And what did we achieve? Nothing. You screwed up completely. No. Now to wait and see what she, what's happened. No. What? Oh, I cannot do anything. I just have to watch while I'm being hacked. He's deleting everything. Please let me listen. This is the group call. Hello, this is working. Is this working? Anybody here? Well, I am. Harry, didn't know if you would still be around. Barely got here in time. Cassie, you've been released. Yeah, thanks to Jossi. Don't know what magic trick he pulled off, but it worked. This is great. <gasps> oh! I'm not quite sure what I'm doing here, but I'm here as well. Jossi, great, you're there. Holy crap. What's going on? What is this? Who are you? A fool who is baffled by the madness he just witnessed. Otherwise, initiate. Well, glad you decided to join us. That's completely unintended. What do you mean? You're in the call, aren't you? Yeah, I'm also in Orwell. In Orwell? Abe sent me an IP address to get into Orwell. It makes hacking the damn thing incredibly easy. He did what? And that worked? Like a charm. I now kind of control the damn thing. It's really, really worrying. Come again? You have Orwell on a freaking leash? Great. How does that worry you? My control is limited and the government will get the control back at some point, but this isn't my primary concern. What makes me nervous is why would Abraham have such extensive knowledge of Orwell? This whole thing reeks of an enormous trap. Abe wouldn't betray us. No, he wouldn't, but you're right. Something very strange is <gasps> afoot. We must get out right now. This is making me jump. And this is the point where it gets even worse. I had a quick look at his file. You would not believe what it says. Abraham is dead. He died quite some time ago. What? That's impossible. I thought that when he first disappeared, but I put it to the back of my mind. What became of him? Dead? No. Abraham, how? He was very sick. Cancer. Uh, you old fool. Why couldn't you tell us? He gave Nina the orders for the bombings after his demise. This means, this means someone has been setting her up real bad, and not only her, all of us. Who do such a thing? Apparently I would. I'm not getting info on who or why. What a pity, but it does prove my point. Wait, what do you mean, Julia? It was me. I set you up. What? Jules, you? Wait a second, I can't believe where this is going. Are you for real? Are you? Are you telling me you told Nina to place those bombs? I did. I'm not proud of it, but I had to be do it had to be done. What the hell? Why? You and Nina, you two ruined everything for Abraham and for sure. So you decided that leaving me wasn't enough for revenge. You had to kill innocent people and blame it all on thought? 
It was necessary. Only when things are at their darkest will people listen. Take notes and actually enact. Abe knew that. I knew it was extreme. Extreme? Extreme is murder. I know, damn it. Believe me, I know. You are the reason I was in custody, Jules. How could you do that to me? Thought needed to be destroyed. That was the whole point of its formation. Instead of seeking me out and arresting me, Orville labelled you all target persons and investigated you all and screwed up your lives. People need to see how messed up Orwell is. Not a, it's not protection, it's invasive and manipulative doom for everyone. No one is innocent, everyone is a suspect. Abe wanted to make the world stand up against things like Orwell. He knew how dangerous the project was, that's why he worked on it. He did what? He worked on Orwell? This confirms what I feared, but I didn't want to believe it. If so, he could have gone to the media and make it all public, couldn't he? He was afraid. He thought nothing would ever change if he did. Can you blame him? He told me everything and only me. Ah, funny. I just realised you were actually much better, yet much worse activist than Nina or me could ever be. That's admirable in a strange and very messed up way. You're nothing but a bitch, Julia. A liar and a killer. Oh, just shut up. Just shut up. It's madness, Julia. First class. First class, then you pull me into this. All those poor people who suffered at your hand. I still don't get it. Why draw all this attention to thought? You didn't convince anyone by your actions. Why this gathering? Why let me hack Orwell? I just needed to convince one person how faulty Orwell was. Costigan, the guy Harry leaked information about, was the man on the inside. Only an advisor, the person who has really been spying on you is still around the person who actually went through your stuff, passed on the data. Ah, that'd be me. The one listening right now, the investigator. That's right, I'm talking to you. I knew you had to be around when everyone would come together. You had to be listening. Initiate was just a windfall. A chance to make sure you didn't immediately go up against us. Investigator, I have a question for you. Now that you saw, well, first hand... Do you really think that the system will help anyone? Did you think the government would not spy on you as well? Did you think you were outside the system? Think again. They evaluated even you. Abe knew that. He saw the madness. They evaluate. I know that. Even you, the investigators. But we can stop it. You can. Remember, you became recruited for being outside of the system. Outside of the nation. But what if we show people what they should are about you? That even you are not outside of the system, that no one is outside of the system. All you need to do, investigator, is upload the data they have on you, incriminating yourself. That is so mind-bogglingly stupid, Jules. Why would the investigator cooperate? This government will come after them. That's exactly the point. This evaluation is supposed to be a safety net so that no one misuses or while acting on evidence is mandatory. If the investigator incriminates themselves, they will be forced to prosecute them and reveal this evidence that the investigators are actually being spied on as well, publicly. It's absolutely mad. I don't see this working. I would like to offer an alternative investigator. Oh, gosh. It just so happens that a certain Catherine Delacroix is in the files, too. I say we make use of the fact that we have control over all. Let us use it as a weapon to turn it against the government. There's something dirty to be found about Mrs. Let them act on that evidence. No, we're talking. No hurting doll Cox, well, she's just going to get replaced. This isn't the right way. Like I said, Jules, just shut up. Nobody's interested in what you have to say, but how can we trust this investigator? Streams up. Here's Cassandra's file. Wow, this feels like a slap in my face. They've been collecting all of this. They got me flagged potentially dangerous. It was this investigator. Yeah, sorry. No, I can't trust that person. I am. Joseph, your turn. My turn? Huh? Hmm? Know what's funny about you, Joseph? Your, about your file, Joseph? It says here you were offered a release of Cassandra for info and thought. And you agreed, especially given the fact that what happened to Harrison. Damn, yes I did. I got this offer and I reported Harrison. I had to. Cassandra would not have been released otherwise. I... I can't believe this. This is horrible, but then again you did it for me. I don't know what to think. Oh, Cass, I'm sorry for Harry. I can't say this anymore. Leave me out of all this crap. User quit the session. Cassie, wait. You've got to do this without me. I'm sorry. User quit the session. 
Well, this is just great. See how messed up all this is. It's exactly what we need to show the people how we've all been affected. Get them to fight with us. Harrison, am I to speak my elaborate opinion, yeah? Yeah, go on, Harrison. Ah, I think this is the f that got me fired. <laughs> yeah, this investigator is the cause for me losing my TMB job. Uh, might well be. Thanks for that, you douchebag. You can rot in the digital limbo of no control you're in right now. I shall speak in behalf of Nina then. I only realised that might have been my fault Nina got investigated in the first place. But it's all clear the investigator is responsible for hunting her down like this. They caused her death, no doubt. Perhaps the investigator didn't know any better. And we know Nina was guilty. It does not strengthen my trust, though. But then, the investigator arrested Harrison. No, no, we cannot trust such a person. I mean, the final verdict is... Not a single vote to trust the investigator. Are we finally going to do this my way? No, we're not. That's it. I'm out of here before this investigator gets control back. User quit the session. It's down to the two of us, it seems. Well, my plan to gather support for you failed, investigator, but if you still want to fulfill my plan, go on and give Delacroix hell. You will find something dirty. Investigator, it's time to make up your mind. You can tear down the entire system. Just complete my plan, please. I will turn Delacroix into a target person. I think I can easily activate access to her PC for you. When Abraham stopped his work for the Rose and the government, he, he cloned all information he had at here in the office. He told me, and I maintained that the system is programmed to boot itself again in a couple of minutes. You'll have access to everything you just need to find the UID of the device. I cannot tell you here now that Orwell isn't tracking data chunks. I have full understanding for you, judge, and incriminate me for what I've done. I think I deserve it. It's up to you now, investigator. Do the right thing. Oh. What do I do? What do I want to do? <laughs> I know what I want to do. Finally, I thought this disturbance would never end. The back-end engineers say we've had an unwanted guest we already know it was, thought it's about time to undo them. We must be strong, we must show the people for what they are, the nation's safety is depending on it. Find a way to incriminate them together as a group, all we need is a hint that Aaron Goldfoss intended this group to carry out terrorist actions. We could trace the attack back so to a remote PC, I will now manually unlock this PC for you. Okay, so I found information that clarifies that Goldfells wanted to do bombings. <laughs> Questionable. <laughs> I'm gonna bring the ship down. Let's just put it all up. I want to see what it brings up. I'm going to hack myself. What? Yes, self incriminating all investigator causes reveal. On project scale parliament stormed by protesters after what yes Government cancels all well government announces immediate termination of all well in passion agency commissioned with the raising stored data permanently. Yes Bottom bomb is masterman Julie Carrington arrested at a first statement Carrington says she commit the bombings for the freedom of the nation's people. Sorry, Julia. Investigator wanted for arrest. <laughs> Investigator entangled with activist group thought want for immediate arrest. Whether their home country will comply to the extradition request remains to be seen.
The investigator who is likely to be in possession of inside of and there is well as projecting on us all well. <laughs> How fitting that it ends with one more data chunk. Big brother is always watching you people. That was fun. That was interesting. I'm glad I got to bring the government down. Surpriseattackgames.com. Good game, guys. Good game. Um, so, kudos to you guys. Hope all you guys enjoyed watching this. And by all means, leave your comments, subscribe, and like if you like the video. Um, or even if you didn't, just do it to be nice. <laughs> anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. And I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.